Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? I'm here today to review something unusual. Uh, Muscle Men's Apple Butter Infusions uh, Mango Habanero Apple Butter from Muscle Men. They're like the applesauce people. Now, I know a long time ago, my friend Chris Show 22 sent me some apple butter, and I got like the little thing of Smucker's apple butter. That's the only time apple butter I ever had was Smucker's, and he sent me some. It was very good. And I saw this at Ollie's. They had a bunch of different ones. Uh... Maybe down the line I might get some more if they still have them. And you have a picture of apple with uh, mango and uh, habanero. I try to get mango everything. And this said their price is two ninety nine. dollars Now all these prices is $1.29. So let's try it out. I got rye bread from Giant Eagle. And I think a uh, uh, loaf of rye, e uh, rye eagle. Yeah, raw eagle or rye eagle. Uh... Rye bread for Giant Eagle is like two twenty nine or something like that. Where locally we can't, we don't have anything like that. I mean, the best deal I get on bread, I would get the. Uh, I mean, if you, unless you want to pay a ton of money at Surefine for like five or six bucks for a loaf of rye, but I don't even know if they sell rye at Surefine. Cause I don't look. I just I started going to Dollar General. Where they have and they they have Clover Valley. They have whole wheat bread for a dollar fifty a loaf. Which is almost the same price they charge their regular white bread at Surefine, so I've been getting that. And if they had a good deal on rye bread, I would get it, but they never do. Uh, and they used to have, like, Pepperidge Farm bread on sale and stuff like that, and they they, don't, they stopped doing that. Well, anyways, Surefine, I mean, you know, and there's, like, a discount bread warehouse. I haven't been to one in a while. I'd like to go to get and load up on the rye bread, definitely. Well, anyways, let's try it. I got a piece of the rye bread. I toasted it. Try the apple butter on it. It had a different thing on it. I squirt it like this. Okay, I'm going to put the apple butter on here. Okay, let's see. Okay. Even. It's pretty nice, this right here. I like it. Coat the whole thing of bread. Okay. I love rye bread, by the way. Okay. Mango habanero apple butter. That's good. That's got heat to it. A little bit of a burn to it. This is good. They have some other ones like Honey Dijon or something like that. I mean, I was loading up on so much stuff from all these. I don't know. I got 15% off coupon from them. I have used up by March 20th. Um. If I see any more of these, I'll definitely pick them up. But I gotta look throughout the whole store for a whole bunch of different things. This is really good. And the mango and the apple kind of kind of clash. Fruit flavored, but I mean it's a very interesting uh, flavor combination. But they clash though. It's hard to explain. And there's a heat to it, which I like. Mm. All right, good. No real information on the back. The story behind why they're doing for anything. Mm. Really good. I give uh, the Muscle Men's Apple Butter Fusions Mango, the Muscle Men's Mango Habanero Apple Butter Fusions, a 10 out of 10. This is absolutely delicious. Very unusable, very good. I have some other spicy jams before too. I mean, it has the heat to it, but not like it melts your face up. But as you're eating the whole this much, you know, eventually you start getting a little bit of a burn. But really good though. You know, ten out of ten for Musselman's uh, mango habanero apple butter fusions. I'm not squaring out, but that's how you show them up. Until next time, everybody, please take care of my legion. Next time I've got all these, I'll see if they have any more of these. I forgot to get the whiskey uh, whiskey barbecue sauce. They probably won't have that when I go back either. All right, take care, everybody. Really good.